Um, I'm going to do this really quickly because apparently I have 8% left of my battery. Um, I'm Kristen. You're watching Our Pagan Opinions, and I'm your Sunday host. My current YouTube channel, oh my god, it's making me really nervous. Uh, it's just bleeping. Um, my current YouTube channel on, well, YouTube is Living Pagan. I have been here for seven months. I'm going to talk really fast now. Uh, my, if I'm not on YouTube, I'm with my dog, Moose, who is 100 pounds, who you will most definitely see, my fiancé of a year, and boyfriend of two years, and, um, my fiancé, Josh, I'm with my family, or really anything like that, um, I'm at work, my best friends, reading, writing, doing anything creative, I design a lot, I design clothes and jewelry, just drawing, I'm just a drawer, um, I do actually make the jewelry, but I don't make the clothes, because I can't do that well. I knit, I crochet, I scrapbook, I read, I'm looking around my room to make sure I'm getting everything. I make cards, I make really cool Christmas tags. Oh my gosh, I made such cool Christmas tags this year, it was fantastic. Um, that's what I do. We're going to talk really quick about my practice. And yeah, so I grew up in a predominantly, well, I, I grew up with a predominantly Catholic family. My grandparents were Catholic and we were with them all of the time. We went to church, we prayed morning, noon, night before and after every meal, um, all the time. We were always praying. And we would go to church. And I have to say, I love churches. I'm just going to put this out there. I love the sanctity that I feel when I walk into church. Like, like, I stopped going to church when I got old enough to realize that the church was hypocritical. And the father, preacher, whatever you want to call him, um, that we used to go to, would say one thing and then damn another. So I, I know I don't understand when people say that God is good and then people go out and kill other people for God's will. That makes no sense to me. God wants everyone to live and, and God has a plan and that's great, but that doesn't make any sense. If God makes people and puts them on this earth, why does he damn them? Because they are as he made them. It doesn't make any sense to me. And so I always would question it. My grandma would just be like, stop questioning it. This is how it is. And I'm like, no, it's obviously not. And when I was in middle school, I started looking into Christianity, which is no better. And um, I'm not even going to go into that because, well, I'm just not. But um, then I met a friend, a couple of friends who actually were, were and are pagan and Wiccan. They are Wiccan specifically, but obviously pagan. And... Um, I started to look into paganism for a few years, and when I was a junior in high school, I really, or was it soft? When I was in high school, when I first started high school, I was like, this is where I want to be, but I, I was nervous to tell my parents, so I didn't practice for a while. And um, when I finally told my parents, they were like, I don't care. This is literally what they said. They were like, you know what? We want you to be happy. We don't care. We're not going to believe it, and that's totally okay with us, but if you're happy, that's fine. Just don't go to any open circles or gatherings or whatever until you're 18 and grand can't have a fit on us and I was like yeah okay we can do that I still to this day I haven't been to an open circle I really want to go though just to observe it first but um yeah and when I I finally like admitted to myself that I was I was I was fully ready to become a pagan and to devote myself it was a year and a half to two years ago and I saw, um, and I actually saw a video um, on YouTube here of our host, Charlie Cisco. And I watched her video and I was like, oh my gosh, this is totally me. I don't even know what video it was anymore. I honestly can't remember. And so I devoted myself to the practice for real. And I've been doing it ever since. And I just came out to my family not too terribly long ago. Actually, this channel was when I came out. Um, I, come, I, I go big or go home, right? So that's what I did. But, um, I, the reason I am pagan, the reason that I love, I love my practice and I love everything is that I am really glad and I always feel very at home within the pagan community. I mean, we don't judge each other. We are together. We're always going to be together. This is... A community and it's actually a community we care about each other we only care about all of us succeeding there's no one trying to take, take somebody else down because what they believe in is wrong or who they are is wrong you're not wrong you're never wrong you're just not what somebody else wants you to be and the great thing about being pagan and being in this community is not only YouTube but just the community itself is that 
It's full of acceptance. That's what we preach. Preach. That's what we believe in is, is acceptance of, a, of another person and of each other. And that's what I love. I love that I can say something and you might not agree with it, but you don't have any right or any place to tell me that I'm wrong. And that's really cool. Um, you have, you have no foot to stand on. I just like that we are whole and we realize that every single person is connected to the other. And I think that's really awesome. I've gone through my life story and why I like paganism. Um, my personal practice, I am obviously an eclectic pagan. I draw from Egyptian, Celtic, and Greek pantheons and practices. Um, I'm really, really excited and proud to be a part of this channel, and I cannot wait to get started even more. So please tune in next Sunday for my next video. And uh, if you have already auditioned to be on the channel, do not fret. You might possibly still be in it. I know. I don't know who else has and has not picked their substitutes. I think I might be the only one left. So I'm going to go through videos as soon as I can plug my laptop in and hopefully choose a substitute. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great week and have a great weekend. And I'll see you next Sunday. Blessed be.